Okay, so this over here is my new black MacBook again. Done a couple videos on it, and uh, a couple people have sent me messages asking, really, what is the difference between the older uh, G4 machines and these new Intel machines? So I happen to have my Mac Mini over here, which is a uh, 1.42 gigahertz PowerPC G4 processor, 512 megabytes worth of RAM, and then we have the new black MacBook. Well, not so new, but a year old. Uh, nine months old or something like that now. Two gigahertz core two duo. Uh two gigabytes worth of RAM. So we're gonna do some performance tests between the two. I'm gonna try to stick to stuff that isn't too RAM dependent. Uh rather things that are processor dependent. We're gonna do some video uh video compressing, we're gonna do boot time, uh, a couple other things. So uh you can see for yourself exactly how much faster these uh new Intel machines are and whether or not it's really worth the money to uh upgrade your computer now. So uh, I don't know. Without any further ado, we'll get on to uh, a couple of our little tests. Okay, so test one, uh, video compressing. We have iMovie HD open in uh, both of them. And I have the same exact video file. It's a uh, 2 minute and 20 some odd second uh, MP4 video that we're going to compress to uh, what, uh, what iMovie calls CD-ROM quality. So. What I'm going to do is click save on one, click save on the other, pretty much at the same time we'll give the menu a little bit of a head start. And I'm not going to make you sit here and watch this whole thing because it's going to take a, take a little while, especially for the menu. So what I'll do is, again with our uh, trusty iPod, we're going to time it. And um, I'll just post the, uh, set my thing up over here, post the results, and we'll let you know at the end. So without any further ado, we'll get this set up. Get ready to save quickly on both of them, and go on the mini, go on the MacBook, iPod at the timing, and we'll see what happens. Okay, MacBook is just about finishing up. And we are done at 104 with the MacBook. Mini estimated time remaining. Five minutes. Five minutes. And the mini is just about done. 4.11 for the mini. Okay, so for this one we're going to encode some audio. Got iTunes open on both machines. We have uh, nine songs, a full length record nine AAC files highlighted and we're ready to convert them to high high bitrate mp3s from AAC to mp3 for both machines and uh, again got the iPod ready so we're gonna click click and then uh, end time and go on the mini go on the MacBook and we're stuck. seconds the MacBook is done. The uh, the mini is on uh, track five.
done, 204. Okay, now we have GarageBand open in, uh, in both machines, and I've imported a uh, an MP3 file, same exact file, into uh, into both of the the applications. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna encode it, um, export it. GarageBand calls it exporting to disk. So, got it all ready, all set up. I'm gonna click save, click save, and again we got the trusty iPod, and we'll be uh, we'll be good to go. So. Click on the mini, click on the MacBook. MacBook is done at 33 seconds. Still converting. And here we are with a good old-fashioned food test. This is pretty tough to do with one hand, so I got the computer down on the desk over here and uh, be able to hit them both at the same time. So let me get started with this. Three, two, one. is done at about 25 seconds. Seconds. So that's that. Just figured I'd do a couple tests, show you what these machines do and uh, how they compare to one another, as usual. Any comments, questions, anything like that, feel free to uh, send me a message. Thanks for watching.